Just be the self so rich. Hey YouTube, so this is my store, my new storage I was telling you about. Um, excuse these drawers that I had using to transport stuff from one room to the other. But that's what the top looks like. And it's 10 drawers. And I put this together myself. I had to put it together. Well, I didn't have to put it together twice, but I had to unscrew it because I forgot to put these black things in here. I was putting these black things behind this. But um, overall, it took me about 20 minutes. The instructions were kind of easy to follow, but I was so anxious to put it together. So it was very easy to put together. And this is what an empty drawer looks like. And I'm going to pull it all the way out. And this is how big it is. I put my hand in it. So you could kind of see, like, this is from the beginning. So it's like two full hands. And then it just has a little screw right here for the knob. And it has little plastic knobs. They're plastic. So I'm going to show you the first drawer. Um, the first drawer just has, like, my combs and brushes. My bonnet. It's going to be like head scarves, my flexi rod, and then my heat protectant spray from Suave. That's all I have in the first drawer. The second drawer is hair products and stuff. Some of my hair products is my eyelash glue, this growth protectant for quick weaves because I just do hair. My curling wand glove, flat iron curling wand, leave-in conditioner, anti-frizz, um, different hair oils and serums. Needle and thread, bleach and brush. The next drawer is empty. And then the other drawer under that is empty. Um, this drawer just has all my rings and bracelets. Like all my little rings. And I try to pull the whole drawer out. So this is the whole drawer. And it just has rings and bracelets like I said. So I'm going to close that up. And this next drawer, the last five drawers, is my nail collection. My acrylic nail stuff I'm going to sit on the floor to do this part. The first drawer is my nail tips, which I keep in these bead cases. Um, my brushes and some implements and, like, other files. More nail tips at the back. My acrylic powders, deafen dish, nail glues liquids, um, top coats, primers, um, gel cleaner, and my practice acrylic liquid. So yeah, like I said, that's all nail tips and that type of stuff in this first drawer. This next drawer is my striper paints that I have in this little green container. There's all my little stripers. And no, nail polish cannot stand straight up in this. If I'll show you just an NYX one and a wet and wild one. If you close it, it's going to hit the drawer. So, no, you cannot store your nail polish in here like this. But this drawer just has my striper paints, my nail soak trays, my acrylic um, mixes. They like the glitter mixes. That's all in this drawer. That's what's in this bag. And there's more mixes in this bag. In this bag, this is all the acrylic mixes that... Um, all my glitter mixes that have been mixed with acrylic. Whether I make these or they came from swaps. My flex tape, um, nail polish dryer, super fast, top coat, cuticle oil, I'm a dapping dish, the plastic one, my orally, um, cuticle remover, and more, this is like a pink top coat that I use for like the nail bed, and, and I made this myself, it just has eyeshadow in it. And other random top coats there. That's what's in that drawer. This next drawer is um, this container that I have. Different glitters, spangles, sand, um, some various mixes. Like it's just mostly glitter in here. Like different little bags of glitter that I have got in swaps. Or glitter that I bought myself. This is just how I store it. So like I said, crayon shavings, glitter, sand, little spangles and stuff. Okay, you two, if I was really interrupted by my little stank boyfriend. Um, in this drawer, I also have um, two picks that I use for like different types of nail art and picking up rhinestones and etc. And then I have my little face mask. 
that I use to cover up my face when I'm filing. And there's some gift certificates in here that I could write out to people. And then in this little bead container, I got it from Walmart like a year or two ago. I just have different types of spangles and that's the acrylic mix right there. But mylar and rhinestones and glitter, um, hexes, diamonds. It's just different little things in there. And on the side, I have like some old files and buffers, stuff that I gotta throw away, and that I have like kind of like discarded. So that's what's over here in this little thing. Then I have one little practice finger back there. In this next drawer is my glitter that I got from Lexis that she sent me. This whole pack of glitter from Ross. And I have two little extra glitter containers right here that I, um, came from Dollar Tree. And then I have like my small hexes from Born Pretty and I have some mixed things that I got from somebody. I can't remember who. And colored acrylics. This little bottle. All of this right here was from Born Pretty except for this and this. And um some little beads that I got from a swap. And then some um pink nail bed and like a beige nail bed type thing. This has all like my nail art in it. Um or the stuff I get from swaps and stuff or stuff that I order from like Sam Loves Nails. It's spangles in here, ribbons, stickers, rhinestones, some silicone flowers, rubber flowers, like it's all type of stuff in here. And over here I just have different little rhinestone wheels. Rhinestone wheels. Rhinestone wheels that fell over. More rhinestone wheels and more rhinestones and different shapes like flower stars and hearts. That's right there. That's in that drawer. And then in this last drawer, I have my nail drill, a bag of stuff that's pre-packaged for swaps and stuff. Um, I have my sanding bits, my drill bits, buffing blocks, other buffers, toenail separators, clean files, um, pedicure sets, my brush cleaner drawer, some bags of chalk that I put in swaps and giveaways and back here is just all plastic baggies just a bunch a bunch a bunch of plastic little baggies that I use for swaps and whatnot so you guys that's it that's all of my container the drawers have not filled up track the drawers have been holding all of my stuff they're not hard to close it's just hard to open with one hand and once again this is just another overview of the drawers and I have the plastic white I mean the frosted white color and um i will put all of the purchasing information and stuff in the description bar so please 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 check that out thank you guys for watching i will catch you in the next video